Alright guys, so this is like the fifth, no, not fifth time, like the second time I, I, I'm uh, recording this. The first time I recorded today was like somewhere around, around like 5 a.m. Right now it's around 12. I actually played Spore for about pff, a good three to four hours. And uh, I learned how big the Grox's empire is. The Grox's empire is unfairly big. They have at least 2.1k, uh, like, planets, and they're all, like, little mining planets, because they don't, if they, if their planet's above, like, the terror score of zero, then they die. Like, they, they can't live in that. But, oh my god. So, uh, I think this is gonna be the last video of Spore. Um... Well, at least this video. I'm gonna try to get to the middle of there. Now, I've actually made it to the middle. Like, uh, I actually got the badge, but I wasn't able to go in. Let's see if I can show you guys. Um. Whoa. Uh, oh, that was weird. I even have the whole window f uh, do it. Was it Captain Badge? Collector Badge? Well, I got something for being going, being able to go to the, like the middle of the of the universe which is uh well if it well this is kind of our um hmm. hold on omnipotent <laughs> no but this is our how, how do i say it this is this is basically our universe this is the milky way i think it's the milky way because you can find earth in here i haven't found earth personally you can find earth in our solar system here and uh, also, you could also find, and in the middle, which is the Sagittarius star, a Sagittarius something A to us, which is like this big black hole star, which I've made it to. I've made it to. I got the little thing that popped up that said I, I made it to it, but I haven't. I didn't get be able to go inside because the Grox beat me. I didn't. I didn't have an energy pack of any sort. So uh, now I have an energy pack. So I'm going to try to go head steam right first, and you guys are going to be able to see... Uh, let's see, can you see my travel route? Oh no, I was like, I, I, would, I would take the travel route that I already took then. But uh, I want to show you guys how fucking crazy this is. I, I know, I, I believe some of you guys played Spore, but this game is... Like, once it gets right here, I hadn't, I had wanted to fucking quit the game. I don't want to play it. Like, every two planets I beat of the Grox, I got killed. Like, there was nothing I can do. So, here we go. We're going to start it. We're going to try to keep going. Cry. Cry. We're going to cry. Many, many tears. I don't know why my... Why my, uh... How you call it? What do you call it? Why my cursor's fucking blinking but uh come on come on come on come on come on no I, I, I you're not gonna want to stay in one place for long uh that good thing that arrow like gives you like a little waypoint of where to go i usually get messed up right here because these clusters of stars but this little waypoint gives you a place to uh like points you where to go that little arrow right there now i don't know if you guys can hear anything I believe I went around. I don't think I went through there like that, but we'll try. We'll try the other way. I believe I just kept going straight. Oh, nope. I'm going the wrong way. I'm going the way I didn't go. So let's see if we can make it going the way I didn't go. I want to see what's in the middle of the, st in the, middle of the universe because the like, rocks are defending the middle of the universe. We're just, we're just trying to make our way there. I, pro I probably could have made it if I didn't accidentally if I, if I didn't accidentally blow up one of their ships like one of their ships were attacking me and my turret automatically attacks them so like they they fucking hated me and they already declared war on me and I actually wanted to like team up with these guys like why not but um apparently that's not it's not an option <laughs> well it is an option you can but uh I ended up messing up. Alright, hold on. Let's use an energy thing. That did not... Wait, this... I bought energies for the... Oh, I didn't buy health! I bought energy! I meant to buy health! 
Alright, I better fucking make it. We can use another one, why not? Alright, so we're getting closer. Uh-uh. I don't want to stall while I'm getting so close. I'm so fucking close. I'm so close. Here I am. Middle of the universe. But start zooming in. Zooming in. Get in there. Galactic core. Galactic core. Zoom in. What's in there? What is in there? What is in the galactic core? What is this? Hold on. I actually have the speakers on. I don't... I don't have the, uh... My headphones on. What's in the galactic... You have traveled very far and overcome many obstacles. Along the way, you have encountered many of your diverse, far-flung siblings. Such as few of them will make it this far. Your heroic efforts have proven really deserving. You are the advancement to the next level of your existence. What's our next level of existence? Yeah. Your creative efforts have not gone unnoticed. Indeed, <laughs> they have spilled into these other unseen worlds, just as the world has been enriched by them. It is now time for you to join us. What do you come like? <laughs> uh oh. No, just kidding. It's not scary. Indeed, <laughs> but I say <laughs> they are good. Some of you may ask, who is this mysterious Morix who knows so much and possesses such great powers? I'm glad you asked. Who are you? Wait, are they gonna tell us? Is it gonna be a god or? We're gonna meet God? Steve! That's cool. Yeah. I am Steve. What the fuck? Oh my god, no! Oh my god, you're trying to sell me real estate. What the fuck? Ah. That's so silly. You have, you have been awarded the Staff of Life. Huh. So I did what I planned to do with them. Why is it all wavy like that? I don't like that. Oh, yeah, Black Matter Star within the middle of Sagittarius A. Oh, my God. So we met the all-knowing guy, Steve, which is just basically all-knowing, like, a, I guess, a race that became so advanced that it's able to create life of some sort with technology. And I find that really, really cool. Like, you have no idea, <laughs> you have no idea how amazed. You have been plundered by pirates. I don't care. The Galactic Core... This is the the most amazing thing right here, the Galactic Core. The whole idea, it rehealed my ship and stuff, but let's see, hold on. Did we get anything new of some sort? No, we got, I got the staff. Is it in my cargo? No. The ability to create life, where is it? Oh, Staff of Life. Use on a plan to completely terraform it into an instant. Wow. Now that is awesome, okay guys? I'm just gonna say that right now, that is awesome. Now, the ability to make life just with, like, technologies is, I don't know, it's really cool to me. You know, like I've told you guys before, I really love the idea of space travel and meeting new civilizations. And maybe there are other life forms in, li in like, the universe, but it's probably not in our solar system, just like they showed here. They may be in different star systems, but, um... Who knows? Maybe they're... Maybe we can't be... If one thing could happen... If one thing could happen once... Another thing could it could happen again pretty much you do it once it could happen again That's what I think and this This I, I don't know. I really like this game But I really got like a disgusting taste in my mouth when I got to this part of the game because of the grocks I didn't expect I thought the grocks were just gonna be like a, a, like I don't know maybe like 50 
around like 50 uh, planets, but no, they're over 2k planets. And I've, I, I took out at least 50. I, I remember that. I, I played for hours just trying to take out the Groks. Now there is a thing, you can take out the Groks, but not complete. You can't completely take out the Groks, uh, if you, uh, per se. Now, uh, it was what I mean by you can't take out the Groks. Like, you get this badge that says, or are they, or are they broken, or are they done, or something like that. But, um, this was a really fun game, and I can't believe it got, like, the shit reviews. This game does have replay value. You can play as a different kind of thing. Like, I took the war path, and as you can tell, but I was kind of, like, half and half. I did what was right. I took out war people. I took out people that were bad, uh, per se, um, and I took over their kingdoms just for that. Those are the only, uh only colonies I ever took over were people who were bad or who attacked me or wanted money from me and used force to be able to get it from me like as the as the only only people I really uh, did I only people only really only real people I did but like the only time I ever used force within this game uh, on on this on this part map the, the star map thingy but on when I was uh, playing by my no, when I played in the earlier, you saw me be like this crazy fucking warlord, and I was just, uh, could take it over my planet, which was Astaria 2. Which Astaria is Astrid, or a star, explaining them a star. But, uh, I'm gonna have these guys destroy me, so I'm gonna be able to go back to my home planet, but, um... Oh, I accidentally just destroyed them with my turret. But, uh... I don't know, this is a really fun game. I know there's, like, an expansion pack. There's, like, something Adventures, or Galactic Adventures. I was thinking about adding that to this, but uh, I heard people saying that it pretty much sucks, so there's no point in getting it. So I just got the plain vanilla spore with the little update that actually lets me uh, get my... What is it called? Whatever this thingy is. Get my... My my interstellar drive up by a couple notches. Because you can't really... You can reach the middle, but it's really hard. Um... So let's see. Let's actually let's try that the 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 staff of life. Let's see what the staff of life could do. Cause uh, let's make a planet. Let's see if we can make a planet. The staff of life. Let's see if we could bring life to a planet. Cause I remember remember when I was having issues with terraforming. Yeah. No. Uh. Yeah. I mean. Yeah. Terraforming. Bad. I don't like it. Now let's see. Let's try the staff of life on this planet. What's it gonna do? It's just a big ball of light. Whoa, what the fuck is going on? It's so cool. Look at that. It's like, it's making it perfect. The planet's getting green. Whoa! That is awesome! There's vegetation now. But there's no animals here, so... I, I, I kind of got rid of all the animals. Look at that. The planet just got greener. Ain't that cool. Is there any more? Wow. Oh, what's going on? It just got, just got really white. We're good, right? Terra score three. Yeah, look at that. Wow, that is awesome. But yeah, uh, I really enjoy this game. So if you, if anyone's watching this and they've never played this game, they're on the fence, just get it. It's cheap, or if you don't want to get it, there's you could probably get a cracked version somewhere. Like, getting a cracked version of something is like, super easy if... Uh, you look at it. This game's so old that it, I, you won't be hurting developers if uh, you basically pirate this game or something. But uh, if you really do enjoy it, buy the game. Just just don't have the cracked version, you know? But um, I think that's going to be it for me, guys. Thank you for watching my sport playthrough. It's probably one of my... my the One of the goofiest. Actually, no. Before I say goodbye, I am going to do another sport playthrough. But I'm going to be more of a... How you call it? A, a peace-loving throughout all of the my whole playthrough if you watch from my uh whole playthroughs um me going through each stage i was i was a carnivore so i had to destroy uh destroy people which i didn't really want to i wanted to become an omnivore maybe i'll become an omnivore because uh, you do have that option to choose either one but I, i'll start from phase one again build up my guy try to play someone different because my love gloves to be honest they're goofy they're goofy looking i know they are i know someone there's been comments people like why don't you change their eyes? They look retarded. It was like, I like them that way, but, um, yeah.
yeah, that's that's it for right now, guys. Until next time, I may do this. I don't know when. Maybe sometime in December. Maybe October. But uh, I'll be doing this game again, so be checking that out. And the game coming up next after this is going to be Pokemon Heart Gold. And uh, I know a lot of you have been bugging me for Pokemon games because I took a break from it. But here we go. I'm going to be starting my new Pokemon walkthrough. It's going to be a walkthrough. So uh, until next time, guys, stay cool, stay fresh, and last but not least, stay frosty. I love you, and thank you for subscribing, and thank you for watching through this whole series if you did. Peace. Peace. Live, live, peace. Just peace, bruh. Peace.